Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Farha Intan Anasis I'm from ICP Science Education Class Makassar State University So now we are learning about countable and uncountable noun So let's start it now The first thing we should know about countable and uncountable is the definition What is countable? What is uncountable? So Let's we start first from the countable. So basically, countable are the things that we can count. It can be animals, places, things, foods, or something that we can count it. And uncountable are the things or noun that we cannot count because they are not individual objects. We can talk about it later. So, most nouns in English are countable. They have singular and plural form. What does it mean? Singular means that it's just one. We count just one thing. And we can use a for and before the noun. For example, I have an orange. Or we can say that I see a cat, I see a dog. I have a pen, something like that. And plural mean that is more than one. And also we can put a number before the noun. For example, I have three oranges. Or I have five oranges. Okay, we move to uncountable noun. Same like countable noun, there are some nouns are uncountable too. It means that we can put a number before them and we can use a or and before the uncountable noun. But there are ways to quantify an uncountable noun. We can use muser words or quantifiers to count it. For example, like much, many, a little, a lot a few and many more for example i have one glass of juice while glass is the music words and juice is uncountable noun and another example is one box of cereal two slices of bread and many more so we can use that kind of words to quantify an uncountable noun